So congratulations on a very impressive feature Thank debut. Uh, it's a very moody, like spooky, intense picture. Yes. Yeah. Uh, it's very intimate with like few locations and actors mm -hmm. and also being filmed on location in mm -hmm. Ireland. How was that whole process and experience? It was so, so wonderful. I mean, I think contrary to sort of how the movie feels when you're watching it, uh, every time we called cut, it was just like a joyous environment. There was uh, a lot of laughter um, and playfulness that I think went into making the movie. So it's interesting that kind of juxtaposition of like what actually was captured on camera and what it was like outside. Yeah, and to create this really like creepy atmosphere, mm -hmm. like how do you work with the cast and crew to kind of create that? I think for me, um, it is really sort of like a, kind of comes from the shot making, I think first, where it's very much about the expectation of what you're going to see um, and the feeling of, of that, of, of being like uh, held back from seeing what you want to see. So it was uh, lots of conversations we all had about what those intentions were. We storyboarded everything. I wrote a lot of the kind of tonal things into the script uh, in terms of like sound design and uh, even camera movements at moments. So it was all uh, s stuff that we had prepped kind of going into uh, our shoot days. Okay, cool. Yeah. And this being your feature debut mm -hmm. based on a novel, mm -hmm. is, do you think that's a challenge or is it easier when you have like something to, that it's based on? I found it a bit easier. I think it was um, very taken by the book and sort of had this um, connection to it that I could always draw from. I think it made me as a screenwriter uh, that process like writing can be very difficult and there's moments of being stalled and losing your way and to have a base thing, a base piece of art to work from I think was really helpful in sort of unlocking me. Yeah, um, while trying to avoid spoilers because there's yeah. so much going on, yeah. uh, how, were there a lot of changes from the book that you have to make or? I think it's a quite similar kind of journey through the book. Uh, I did it my best to sort of like honor what he had built there with the um, structure and the characters and the intentions. So it feels very similar. There's just some added sequences and, and things that I sort of built in for the purpose of being in a theater and watching it with other people. Yeah, and coming from Servants mm -hmm. and now this, so it feels like suspense thrillers is kind of your thing a little bit. I think so, yeah. 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 Do you have like some filmmakers that you are inspired from? Um, yeah, I mean, so so many different filmmakers. Yeah, they're actually like I think most of my sort of faves are are not necessarily in the horror genre. I, like I always say, Kieslowski is one of my favorite filmmakers. Um, just that sort of yeah balance of like surrealism in in a very emotionally grounded space. So I think I'm. Yeah, drawn to to artists who like play with form a bit, um, and I'm interested to do the same thing. I think within the horror genre. All right. Yeah. And uh, when it comes to scary movies, do you have some personal favorites of yourself? Yeah, I love The Ring. It's one of my faves. Scares me still. <laughs> yeah, and actually, yeah, Ringu, the original, yeah, one I think is so scary as well. Yeah. Um, yeah, and I love It Follows. That's like I think modern horror classic. So. So many, I love them all. I watch, I watch all of it. <laughs> okay, well, nice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and last question. Speaking of uh, horror filmmakers, mm -hmm. with your last name, mm -hmm. do you feel that there's like an expectation coming from this, like your first film? I think so. I mean, um, I think uh, the hope is sort of that the when you're experiencing the art, that you're not thinking about those things, that you're sort of it's a movie for the audience and and uh, for them to sort of enjoy and be riding along with. So um, try try not to like use that as a as a thing I'm thinking about too much. Uh, but yeah, it's definitely um, yeah. Try to sort of be be just like as honest and truthful to my own sort of artistic perspectives as possible. Yeah, sounds perfect. Yeah, thank you. All right, thank you very much, and <laughs> uh, enjoy you. the rest of your Lovely day. Lovely to meet you.